Tribunal judges panic over trades by Tidumbu and APC. Of course, it is no longer news that uh, the lawyers of uh, Tinumbu made a statement talking about uh, anarchy or no anarchy or whatever. And also because of uh, this uh, 25% and they, they've made an assertion. Some people are saying, oh, it is not a trade. They're just trying to state the obvious. What is uh, stating the obvious there? They have not even come out to debunk it. I heard uh, Ruben Abbasi saying that oh, Nigeria should not interpret it the way they, that that was not what he meant literally. But that was what the statement said. Even the lawyer and the APC people have not even come out to debunk it. So I don't know why some people are saying that uh, that was not what it meant literally. But they didn't put water in their mouth. They said it that if they are going to disqualify him based on 25%, that means there's going to be chaos. There's going to create chaos. And the Labour Party has responded that in as much when you were being sworn in, there was no chaos. Even if you are going to be removed, there's not going to be any chaos. So all these threats should just they should just perish all these uh, thoughts of uh, all these uh, statements or try to blackmail. And some people are saying that a uh, judiciary has been, you know, they are trying to blackmail the judiciary. Of course. You should know what could be going on for them to have made that statement. I don't know whether they are beginning to see the handwriting on the wall. A lot of people have interpreted the 25% or no 25%, uh, whether to third or no to third. Abuja is not a special state, it's a special state, uh, and what have you. A lot of people have argued this over and over again. And I'm sure majority of the APC people, well, they say it was even so, it, it, it wouldn't have been easy for them to manipulate it. Uh, what is it called to manipulate uh, the results of uh, Abuja? Maybe they could have done that. Maybe if that one had been done, definitely this issue of 25% because this is very, 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 very strong. The question a lot of people have been asking is that who has been president in this country since 1999 without uh, winning the FCT? Nobody. This is the first time we are seeing somebody who is not a president who did not win the um. Who did, who did not, not even winning, just even having 25%. No, nobody's even talking about winning, but that's 25%. And that is a very strong signal to many people that this man did not win, even in his own state. The Lagos he built for his people or he built for Lagosians, that now Lagosians can be proud that, yes, we have a developed uh, state in Nigeria. They should be happy. Why is it that they did not vote for him? Somebody was asking the question that what made people not to vote for him in that same Lagos. So, not to talk of Abuja and from the feelers that we are getting that in all the military formation in Nigeria, that Peter will be won in all of those places. And so, uh, some people who are saying that, uh, oh, the, the FCC does not matter, this and that. If it does not really matter, I see no reason why they will be issuing that a uh, Threats, that statement of threats, they shouldn't, they wouldn't have, they would have, they wouldn't have even be, been bothered. The same set of people who said that uh, there was no point having uh, witnesses in court, that there was no point having witnesses in court because those, all the cases are just a uh, trash that needed to be thrown into the bin. And that is the, the, the council, Tinubu council telling the tribunal, I just control them, we don't have a uh, what it is. And also, the reason why these guys will be panicking, <laughs> like they always say that the Nigeria president is the most powerful president in the whole world, because even the U.S. that they talk about, the India U.S. There's this uh, system that that guides system that guides the the presidents of that state, of that country. But in Nigeria, there's so much power they have given to the president is so powerful that he can do and undo. But even at that. The Tinubu APC and the supporters, especially the supporters, might not know, but the like they always say that he who wears a uh, shoe know where it knows where it pinches, because hey, it might not be as it might not be business as usual, and uh, maybe that is the reason why they are bringing out or putting out the statements out there. Hmm. Don't go and do anything funny or you these uh, judges. So why do you expect how do you expect them not to to be to be afraid? They will be panicking. They must be panicking. 
Because it is not everybody that is corrupt. Too. Mm, even as people are saying, hey, judiciary, all lies on you. Don't go and do any. Uh, we know that you cannot trust the judiciary. Some people have said, don't just even bother yourself. They already know the outcome of the judiciary. So don't just even bother yourself. But because of uh, the way a lot of things have been happening or had happened in the past and still happening. But that does not mean that everybody is corrupt. Because some people just believe that they mm, why should they be afraid? They just give them money or give them something. <laughs> when you see when you see money, maybe you go change your mind. But it's not everybody. Mm. In as much a uh, uh, Nigerians are, are being looked down upon because of corruption of our so called leaders. When we talk about the uh, people who are into all this uh, uh, crime, it is the same people who have been elected. It is in the uh, uh, coffers of the of the country that you'll be hearing billions of nairas are missing. Who are the custodians of the the money? Is it not the same politicians? So for the fact that uh, some people are misbehaving doesn't mean that uh, everybody is bad. So that is why some people might be panicking that hmm, it's either you join them or you go your separate way. And you know what that means? A lot of them are just panicking that what could be because with the evidence on ground, not to talk of a adding sort of an injury with the report of the EU, where well, your guess is as good as mine. Nigerians are still hoping, but some people have lost hope that forget about it. It is not possible. They will do their usual way. So guys, let's say your opinion and have your take.